All right, so hello, hello, good people. Welcome to the Daily Digital Design Show. My name is Junior, and this is the very first episode of the Daily Digital Design Show. Uh, if you haven't listened to the introduction, this show is gonna be all about digital design, uh, entering into the metaverse, entering into NFT space, cryptocurrency, stuff like that. So as you all probably know already, title of this episode is called what is the metaverse so we're going to be talking all about the metaverse uh, if you don't know what that is then stay tuned if you do know what it is this may be a little bit of insight for you so check back here in a second So what is the metaverse? Well, you probably have been hearing a lot about it lately. Uh, the rise of cryptocurrency and NFTs has brought into the metaverse. A uh, company called Facebook, everybody probably knows it, this big social media conglomerate. Um, they just changed their name to Meta because they wanna become the first and only metaverse space that is out there. Well, to me, that is not even possible. Uh, the metaverse, if you think about it, our entire universe has what we call planets on it. And the metaverse is basically just another universe that's inside the digital world, inside the virtual reality. And it would be impossible for Facebook to own the entire universe because there's going to be a bunch of different you know, planets, there's a bunch of different companies out there that's going to have their own space inside of the metaverse. Again, if you think about the metaverse as being a separate universe, um, it's going to be really, really hard for you to enter into the space and then control the whole entire thing, uh, especially with now cryptocurrency has brought about decentralization. Uh, if you don't know what decentralization is, it's basically where not one company, not one business, not one government owns everything. Uh, it's going to be bringing back ownership into the actual users and to people like us. And you probably haven't really realized it, but we've been inside of the metaverse for quite some time now, especially when cell phones came out um, and then all these smartphones and everything. Once we entered into that virtual space, into that digital world, that was basically the metaverse. We just never really put a name to it. So I'm gonna read the actual definition of what the metaverse is. So the metaverse is a virtual reality space in which users can interact with a computer generated environment and other users. So if you think about it, all of these video games that we have now here today, uh, think about Fortnite, think about Roblox, think about Minecraft, all of those video games, they are already entering into the metaverse space. And again, if you think about the planets in the universe, Fortnite is its own planet, has its own entity and everything. Um, Roblox is its own planet, and as well, Fortnite is its own planet as well. And it's not only just with gaming. So the metaverse can also include stuff that we do around work. A lot of people since the pandemic has spent a lot of time on Zoom, interacting with that virtual space, talking with colleagues and friends, stuff like that. Um, there's a lot of different apps out there that we can use that bring us into the metaverse. So I feel like anytime that you really tap into that virtual world, that digital space, um, you're entering into the metaverse. And again, we've been doing this for years now, since possibly 2010, even before that. So you're probably wondering why are you just not hearing so much about it? Well, one main reason is because coronavirus. When the pandemic happened, a lot of people spent a lot of time indoors and we were forced to take to the virtual world. We were forced to do things digitally since we could not do them physically. So that opened doors into a whole new world, into the metaverse. Uh, again, a lot of people got into the cryptocurrency. A lot of people got into NFTs and stuff like that. So now that we see there's a lot of more interest in it, everything is starting to take shape. Everything is starting to fall into place. There's a lot of big name companies out there, again, such as Facebook, who recently just changed their entire name to Meta. Um, they're starting to invest inside of the metaverse. They're starting to see that there is opportunity, there is potential being inside of the metaverse and bringing everyone there with them. 
and soon you'll see how we do a lot of things will change. Uh, I just recently heard that companies are starting to do job trainings when they do interviews and stuff like that inside of the metaverse. That way they don't have to meet with a bunch of different clients. They can still work from home and be with their families and still be able to get work done. So I'm curious to know what you all think about the metaverse. Me, I'm kind of on the fence with it. I'll tell you guys why a little bit later once you really get deep into what the metaverse is and how it will all work out for us. But again, want to know what you guys think first. So thank you for listening in and I'll check back in with you all tomorrow.